Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to, wait, hold on, let me get better lighting. Boom! Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to another Gore's trailer reaction and this one is for Kingsman, The Secret Service, the third trailer, and this one is a Red Band trailer. So that title up there is going to be really long. It's going to be Gore's Kingsman, The Secret Service, Red Band trailer, number three, review slash reaction. That's a long ass title. But, um, yeah. I'm really looking forward to this movie. I am. It got delayed. It was supposed to come out in October, and now it's coming out in February, which worried me a little bit because February and January, January are when Hollywood kind of dumps their movies out just to make some money and don't give a shit about quality. But I'm hearing actually really good things about this film, like early reactions because the movie got screened to some critics before it got delayed, and now they're not allowed to review it until... Uh, it comes out in February, but I've been hearing good things, like, you know, like, really good, enjoyable stuff, like, you know, like, hey, it's fun, it's goofy, I like it, it's good, so I'm actually looking forward to this, it's directed by Matthew Vaughn, who is a great director, directed X-Men First Class, Kick-Ass, uh, Layer Cake, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure he did Layer Cake, Layer Cake was great, but, um, he's a great director, so, let's see how good this looks, and I didn't know, actually, I, I really did not know this was going to be a rated R film, I should have assumed, seeing that Matthew Vaughn is directing, the only other R-rated film he didn't direct, I mean, I, the only other not R-rated film he directed was uh, X-Men. So, let's watch this. Ooh, that red band. I don't think I've ever watched a red band trailer so far. I probably have. We are an independent international intelligence agency. Yeah, Colin Firth. Kingsman. That was the headline the day after I defused a dirty bomb in Paris. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Oh, snappy. news on all these occasions was nonsense. What? It's the nature of Kingsman that our achievements remain secret. Ooh. Cool. I think this is fucking thing, though. How fast does fucking thing go? Being a Kingsman has nothing to do with the circumstances of one's birth. If you're prepared to adapt... Ooh, parkour. You can transform. Oh. That is sick. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes. Very, very nice. I love that quote. Oh, yes. Very nice. Oh, there's a lot to lose. I guarantee it. I love the way Samuel Jackson is acting in this film. Mastercide? He's got a slur. Crazy. Now look like I give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I said, the king's man. Oh. What is this to electrocute you? Don't be ridiculous. It's a hand grenade. Shut up. Oh. No violence so far. Oh, oh. It's a bit much, isn't it? It's probably a little too soon. Oh man, what? What is going on? <laughs> this, this movie looks insane. Oh, she got metal legs. Oh, she's badass. Oh. <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't, that looks so different from the other trailers, just because it was our, <laughs> it was our rated trailer, I don't, I, I can't wait for that, I really can't, it looks like a throwback to just the cheesy spy thrillers of like uh, the 70s and the 80s, even the 90s, and even some from the early 2000s with some of the James Bond films, like the Pierce Brosnan ones. That looks like it could be a lot of fun. I love, I love that it's rated R. I, you don't see too many of these uh, um, spy thrillers like this uh, that are, you know, cheesy and corny. That are actually going to be really violent and curse all the time. And have sexual innuendos and stuff. Perfect for me. I, I love all three of those things. So, I am actually really looking forward to that. It looks like it could be one of the most entertaining films of next year. I have a feeling it's going to be one of the most forgotten films, though. Even if it is... 
a good film. It's probably not going to make too much money. I have a feeling. It just it doesn't look like a movie a lot of people are going to rush out to see, even if they hear it's good. Uh, it's not a stupid-ass horror film or a uh, romance film, so, you know, the girls ain't going to see it, you dummies. No, I'm just kidding. There are plenty of smart women out there. I mean, I know, I know you exist. Me, date me. So, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, this uh, trailer looked like a lot of fun. Uh, negatives. I need to think of a negative. I don't know. Uh, the energy might be a little bit too much for some. It's so energetic. And it's just all like it's always snapping to different scenes. It's just like so quick. That could be a problem. And all, of course, you know, if you don't like uh, sexual jokes or whatever, it looks like there's gonna be a lot of that. Also, I could see Sam Jackson getting a little tired for people. So you know, his his stick pretty much where he just says, you know, motherfucker, you know, just randomly, just you know. I, I'm not, I'll never get tired of it. I love Sam Jackson. I'll see him in any movie. So it, it, it's cool that he's going to be a villain, which uh, we've seen him play but uh, as a villain, but I want to see him again as a villain. So anyway, I'm going to give this, uh, I'm going to give this an 8.5 out of 10. It looks like it could be a lot of fun. I'm really looking forward to that. Um, there you go. There's my uh, review for the trailer. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you and goodbye.